So one of the things that we see happening more and more often nowadays is paying a bill by credit card, right? So you have a bill in there and then it comes time for you to make your payment to your vendor. And instead of having the cash in the bank, sometimes we need to put it on a credit card. It just happens nowadays, right? So how do we do that to properly record it? So you go up to vendors and pay bills just like you would if you're cutting a check. All right, let's just say I'm going to be paying uh, Connor and Townley off by my credit card instead of by check. All right. First things first, when you're going to pay by credit card, you want to make sure to put the payment date in here because you don't have the opportunity after the fact. It just automatically posts. So make sure you get the payment date right. And you click on down here and you're going to say I'm going to pay by credit card. Okay. Now it gives you the option on the side. Notice how it doesn't mark to be printed or anything like that over here because there's nothing to print on a credit card transaction, right? You're just going to be either calling the vendor and giving them their credit card number or the vendor already has it on account. So you choose which credit card account you're going to put it on. I'm going to put it on the MasterCard for now. And you go ahead and say pay bills. Okay. So then it gives you the option to go back and pay more bills or if you're all done for the day, you can say done. So now when I go into my chart of accounts here and I look at my register, I show those two bill payments in here as being paid by credit card. 